After a four overtime victory in the section championship, the Roseau girls hockey team earned themselves a trip to their first state tournament in three years. The Rams drew a tough first matchup as they took on second seeded Blaine in the Class 2A quarterfinals. Early on in the first, Bengals with a good look at the net, but Kiana Flagg makes the big stop to keep this one scoreless. But she couldn't keep Blaine out of the net long. A minute 54 into the game, Abby Jones lights the lamp off the centering pass from Megan McKenzie. Roseau would get a few good looks in the first, rattling off 11 shots, including this look from Annika Stoskop, but Jayla O'Brien held stout. The Bengals would lead by three after a period thanks to the first of two goals from Gabby Rosenthal. They'd just roll from there, but in the third, Rozo would finally get one across. Gina Wensloff goes top shelf with the backhand, but it was too little too late as Blaine rolls to a 7-1 victory. Here's head coach Steve Huglin after the game. They could feel sorry for themselves and, and say, wow, we just got shellacked there, and this is all no good from here on out. Or the other way to look at it would be to say, you know what, it doesn't matter if we got beat by the score we did or if we would have gotten beat 2-1 to one in three overtimes. We'd still feel pretty much the same way. Uh, we lost when the consolation round. So what you have to do right now, I think, is just hit the reset button, move forward, and try to do your best to to win two games in the consolation round and if you do it's um, most teams are going to think that that's a successful tournament so uh, I think that's the way the girls will handle it they've come back from adversity before so I think they'll respond in a positive way and I think I think you'll see a good hockey team tomorrow from out of us if you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland news please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television